Okay, everybody, game for you from GameAnyone.com, and we're playing Master Chu and a Drunkard Who! And Matthew's back, finally. And yeah, this is Master Chu and a Drunkard Who! I mean, it's not much. It's a uh, illegal game, it's got a crappy story, and really good gameplay, in my opinion. <laughs> Not. You get to get drunk. Basically, I'm using I'm going to use turbo the entire time because I'm not going to mash the buttons, and uh, that's a spread shot right there I got. Mm. Like every great side scroller, a spread shot is the most powerful weapon. But of course. And yeah, this basically you have to go around. That's a right there. That's a invulnerability thing or invincibility, whatever you want to call it, and it just makes you invincible. And basic, basically, you go through every level and collect eight yin yang symbols. Yin yang. That's basically the entire game. What? Just eight and you're done? Well, you'll see. Okay. I'm not quite sure what that thing was, it just went across the screen, but. Okay! <laughs> oh, you can get up to three power ups at one time. That's the most. That little gold man, he gives you life. You can get up to three power ups. At a time, and you can get a spread shot that shoots in two directions, or and then get one that shoots two directions up and straight. Now the boss, he's pretty easy. He's a giant tree. Awesome. Basically, just jump over him like that and shoot him some in the back, and then jump over and shoot him in the is back, he a and then tree? jump, and shoot him in the back. Julian, is he a moving tree? <laughs> oh my god. He's a <laughs> Wow. Then you have to shoot the pot right there, and it'll give you the key. It doesn't. The key doesn't show up. You have to shoot the pot to make the key show up. Oh, not, not two or round two. Not like uh, my. Now, one. really, these um the symbols and stuff like that. It's not a real pattern of. Don't follow my playing of how to get the stuff because it uh is random. <laughs> and you pretty much have to shoot every space that looks different. On the screen, and then most of the spaces are actually, uh. What's well, confusing? You... you just shoot a lot and they appear. Yeah, pretty much. I want Secret Castle is a little bit better. No, this game's actually. I actually enjoy this game. Uh, yeah, I, I think so it's better, you know? Yeah, it's actually I mean. somewhat. I watched. The reason we were doing this one, I watched Angry Video Game Nerd last <laughs> night. And then at 1 o'clock in the morning, downloaded the game, and at 9 in the morning today, recorded the game. And that, that little pearl out there, that'll give you some life, but at the same time you lose life to get it, so it's not worth it. Was he hovering a few moments ago? He does have a habit of somewhat looking like he's hovering. <laughs> and I'm not showing it off, but oh, I think it's here, this battle or the next one, I showed off something really important. No. There it is, if you use your fan, which is your B button, <laughs> then uh, you will go and <laughs> you can block attacks, and I think I, I'm not sure if I die right here or not. Mm -hmm. This is my little uh, show off the fan. They gave you two more lives, right? You start off with three. That's pretty but Yeah, generous. I got them. You have to shoot that. Now, the one thing, the keys always stay in the same place. But yeah, uh, you start out with, I think, two lives, and I got three lives. I haven't died yet. <laughs> No death run. Oh, please, that's... no. <laughs> I, in about two levels, I'm gonna die really fast. What are those worms doing? They're walking. They're walking. They do. Pretty much the spread shot, it makes it really easy to find stuff if you can shoot in two places. Okay, these dragons are, like, turrets, so you gotta kinda shoot them. And until there's a little explosion like that, and it'll stop them. Now, surprisingly, I only saw one... Let's play of this out there, and it was from Corn Shack. Wow. I'm, it does appear like I'm hovering, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Also, when you get the eighth one, it'll you'll just come, drop down to the middle of the screen, and fly across the screen. There's a great little uh. Oh, you recycled the tree, man. Yeah, they recycled a lot of bosses in this game. <laughs> Yeah, that's what happens when you die. You curl up in a ball and cry, and then stand back up. That's what happens when you die. Yeah. I haven't seen that yet. It's... Oh, and you can kill the fire. You mean put it out? <laughs> not kill it. No, I mean kill the fire. You shoot it with your energy blast from your hands, and it 
kills the fire. That's the worst way to lose a life. Brought all up in a ball <laughs> Basically, those Shiva things there shoot you, so you gotta shoot them till they explode. Anything else that doesn't explode? Well, there actually surprisingly is a lot of explosions in this game. There's an example of the three shot, very useful for killing stuff. Ooh, little golden man. I'm not sure how that gives you life, but I don't care. Pretty much you want to get rid of those because they will uh, kind of screw you over if you don't. Like later on, the bullets just keep flying at you. I don't. I think this was the level where I went and completely missed, um, like three of the um yin yang symbols. In the other back track. Yeah, but I got the one at the very beginning, so you get to see. Yeah, this is it, and you got to see a very nice little bit of what happens when you pick up the ape's uh, symbol. Are those keys? I'm not sure what they were. <laughs> if you can't tell, he's on Skype and a little bit lagging. Yeah, it is. But that's expected, so that's why we're really not talking too much about the game. Well, what's happening in the game? Well, I can. It's like... Really, there's not much to talk about, though. Oh, God, I am crying again. <laughs> it's funny, because if you're on a platform and you die, you fall right through it and then curl up in a ball. Okay, here we go. You're gonna love this, Matthew, when you see it. And it makes a really cool sound effect when it does it. <laughs> I'm not to the party yet. You just curl up and you fall crying right now. Oh, yeah, you're way behind. I'm way behind. Well, I'm already at the boss fight on my end. I'm guessing Master Chu is... a Buddhist or something? I'm playing as... I'm playing as Master Chu. If you play this game two players, you can have Master Chu and a drunk or two on the screen simultaneously. Oh, we should have done that. And to make it better, the drunk or two uses a knife instead of a fan. <laughs> make Laura be the drunk or two. Nah. Why not? I don't want to play a game with her. Okay, these little totem things here. You want to shoot them, and you want to get rid of those guys shooting the purple, because they really hurt. Purple, purple. Hmm. That's basically back to uh, doing the exact same again, collecting eight yin yang symbols, and doing the same thing over and over. Killing spiders and good crap like that. Shooting totem poles. Ow, hitting, jumping into a spider. I don't like spiders. I know. Oh god, now I get trapped in the middle of one of those purple things. If they can get you where uh, you're safe from the blast, but not getting, but uh, trapped in between two of the blast, and you're pretty much uh, screwed because you're gonna get hit. You mean like on the ground? Where, you know, they're, they're not angled towards you. Yeah, like you're standing on a platform or something, and it, the two of them are angling right past you and missing you. Uh, if you're pretty much screwed there, you're gonna have to take a hit. Like right there again for the third time this level. Good thing you have a life bar. Yeah. And now we fly down to the door. I love how when you get all eight symbols, you go flying. <laughs> a little bit of fire right there so I can uh, kill him better. Ah, oh, God, I'm crying again. And I don't know why here, but it glitched up and for some reason, for like, this entire fight, I died I think twice and it didn't take away a single life. Hmm. Well, it's not as glitchy as Chitaman too, so don't be complaining. No, it's not. This is actually, in my opinion, this is actually a good game, so. It's a good bad game. Yeah, basically all the bosses are the exact same. And this level is basically the same. <laughs> Actually, I think, yeah, right now I'm on the level where most of uh, the video game ner Angry Video Game Nerds uh, video took place. Nah. Only pro problem is I don't have a little shit pickle next to me uh, helping me out. Shit pickle. 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 I should pick up a Oh man. 
Yeah, I'm not quite sure how that spider would be able to climb down off the web into midair and fly, but... <laughs> Well, it's probably just... harder for him, considering he, had, he didn't have a turbo. Oh, this right here is really weird. I'm not even quite sure what I'm standing on when I get this, uh, scroll right here. I'm just, like, flying. And usually, like, if you get the little symbol on the door, you just go into the door. Oh, this one's interesting, because it's got these two little, uh... Faces? Yeah, faces, and they, uh... They shoot you. <laughs> And basically, you just shoot them until they're dead. Disney's... Dead? Please. Could you repeat all of that? What? Could you repeat that? It kind of screwed up on my end. No, oh, I said... I said Disney should, like... Like, have a lawsuit or something. It looks like he's from Beauty and the Beast, sort of. I'm thinking more of, um... The, uh, what's his name? The guy from Hercules. The guy from Hercules. The half man, half goat guy. Uh, oh. Well, no, I mean. Uh, like, it looks like both of them, really. Uh, they so both they, had a lot they of similarities. Lawsuit for, for both of them. <laughs> How about that? Oh, you're gonna love when we get to the boss rush. There's a boss rush? <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be in the next episode. I figure I cut off after 14 minutes and, uh. Go straight to the boss rush after that. I have a boss rush when you already fought like the same bosses like two or three times. Why not have a boss rush? All good games have boss rushes. That's awesome. Yeah, I tried to get that one to double shot and it didn't work. I don't know why this level. Ah, oh, god, those stupid hell hour thingies are back. I don't remember why this level took me as long as it did the bead, because I. Yeah, I got hit by the purple flower and started crying again. Shameful, you crashed on the ground. It's weird because after you die, your life's not completely full. What? What? What was that little man that jumped up? Hey, that's what you get to use to get life. That's why I said, like, now, like, oh, 15 minutes uh, ago. Yeah. The little gold, for some reason, the little gold man's what gives you life. No. Oh, so the, like, the little Lucas logos. I guess. I personally do not understand any of it, but... <laughs> oh, right. Then again, it's Master Chu and the Drunkard Who. What's there to understand? There's a... uh, That's not the last one. Yeah. Are we gonna do Zen and the Galactic Ninja? Yeah, we can do that. Lord Contaminous. That's the most environmentalist game ever. <laughs> there's oh, a, if you I think there's like a cartoon or okay. something. But... I think there's a uh, comic book about it. It was a comic book. If you want, you can do Wally Bear and the No Game. Oh, no, no, no. I want to play a good game. Zen and the Galactic Ninja is actually pretty good. That actually is a pretty decent game. It was released at the end of the Nintendo's lifespan. Thank you, Mr. Information Man. Ah, oh, man, I'm crying again. <laughs> I think that's the last... I believe that's the... I only lose one more life in this game, and I'll be done losing lives. And and you get these, like, the uh, flying all the way to the very <laughs> end right there. That's awesome. It, it makes a really cool noise when it does that. This guy's a... This, it's basically the same. Jump over him, shoot him some. Jump, shoot, jump, shoot. <laughs> I'm trying to give a strategy guide here, but there's no strategy guide. Just after about four shots of his jump, and he'll jump back and then walk over some. And it's not exact, but it's, it's the best I can give. I got a question. How would this game be without the turbo controller? Oh god, it'd be terrible. <laughs> the, the key's up there in the top right-hand corner, green pot. Looks like you need okay, to and basically it that's it for this episode. So this has been Game for You for Game Anyone.com. Starting a boss rush next time. Please rate and subscribe.